Good morning children. Today we are going to start with the new lesson vegetables. Okay? From the book Tit Bits of EVS. So now open to page number 13 and let's begin our new lesson. We are going to revise this lesson. We have already done this lesson. So this is just a quick revision. So here we are. Have you all opened your books? Chapter 7 Topic Vegetables So children, vegetables are very important part of a diet. You know, it is very important. We all should have vegetables. Now, the important thing of vegetable is that most of the vegetables are tasteless. So we add salt to add some taste in them some vegetables are eaten raw as salad and some mostly vegetables we cook and eat so how we should cook vegetables you know we should first wash them cut them and then cook we should add salt in it and then we should eat okay the important thing is that we should always wash our fruits and vegetables before eating and also cut them which is very important so let us revise vegetables the first vegetable is red red tomato spelling of tomato t o m a t o tomato potato p o t a t o potato Onion. This is the vegetable which makes us cry. O and on. I O N. Onion. Brinjal. B R I N J A L. Brinjal. It is called the king of vegetables because it has a crown on its head. Okay. This is chili. It is very spicy in taste. Oh my God. Nobody loves to eat it. Spelling of chili is C H I L L I chili. Cauliflower. This vegetable is named as flower because it looks like a flower. Spelling of cauliflower is C A U L I cauli F L O W E R flower. Cauliflower. Pumpkin. P U M P pump K I N kin pumpkin. Cabbage, C A B B A G E. Cabbage, C A B cab, B A G E. Cabbage. Capsicum, C A P cap, S I C C U M cum. Capsicum. Peas, P E A S. Peas. Parsley. Children, this is a leafy vegetable and is just it just looks like coriander it texture is just like coriander we all garnish our food with coriander same goes with parsley they all gar garnish our fruit uh, vegetables when we cook we put parsley on top okay to so just to add some taste in our food p a r s pars l e y le parsley then the next leafy vegetable is spinach. S P I N spin A C H H spinach. Spinach is a very healthy vegetable. It is full of iron and there is a cartoon character Popoy the sailor man. He loves to eat spinach and he grows strong when he eat spinach. Okay? The next vegetable is cucumber. Cucumber we eat as Salad also. We eat in our salad cucumber, tomato, radish and carrot. These vegetables are eaten in salad also along with onion. Okay. So the spelling of cucumber is C-U-Q-C-U-Q-M-B-E-R. C-U-C-U-M-C-U-M-B-E-R. -E cucumber. Are you getting it? C U. C U M C U M B E R Cucumber. The next vegetable is lady's finger. Now this vegetable is named after lady's finger because ladies have very thin fingers. 
so that is why it is named after them so the spelling of lady finger is l a d y apostrophe this is apostrophe and this is s apostrophe s f i n f i n g e r ger finger bottle god b o t t l e bottle g o u r d god bottle god radish r a d i s h radish yes this is carrot c a r r o t carrot La rabbit loves to eat carrot isn't it it is very good for eyes so we should all have carrots and the next part is we have some questions here in the book can you all see these questions now let's see what are they let's answer them question number 1 which vegetable looks like a flower i have told you just now when i was explaining you the chapter answer cauliflower looks like a flower question 2 children are afraid of which vegetable answer children are afraid of chili yes you all don't like chili your mother doesn't put chili in your food isn't it question number 3 name one leafy vegetable spinach is a leafy vegetable question 4 Which vegetable is purple in color? You have seen in the picture. Brinjal is purple in color. Question five: Which vegetable makes people cry? I have told you earlier. Answer: Onion makes people cry. So, children, this was a quick revision of the chapter vegetables. I hope you will learn all the vegetables with spellings, and you will put the finger and read. Always remember whenever you do reading put your finger on the picture or on the word when you read so thank you